असलम डियर स्टूडेंट्स गुड मॉर्निंग होप यू आर फाइन टूडे वी आर स्टार्टिंग अ न्यू टॉपिक दैट इज शेप्स एंड द सब टॉपिक इज टू डी शेप्स और टू डायमेंशनल शेप्स लर्नर्स बुक पेज नंबर एटीन सो टेक आउट योर लर्नर्स बुक एज वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट टू डी शेप्स फर्स्ट वी गो थ्रू इट्स लर्निंग ऑब्जेक्टिव to sort name describe visualize and draw 2d shapes referring to their properties identify simple relationships between shapes and recognize common 2d shapes in different orientations so these are the learning objective regarding 2d shapes and we are going to learn that now we start with anticipation Com question complete a a square has dash corners Do you remember the shape of square? Good. Do you know how many sides and corners it has? Yes, a square has four corners. Good. B. A circle has dash side. Do you remember the shape of circle? Do a circle shape has sides or corners? No. So, how many sides it has? We write no because circles have no sides and no <coughs> corner. Let me write it neatly. Now, C part. A rectangle has dash sides. Again, a shape, rectangle shape. Can you tell me its sides? How many sides it has? Good. A rectangle has four sides. D. A triangle has dash corners. So, how many corners a triangle has? Recall your shapes. In your mind. think about the triangle shape and tell me its corners good a triangle has three corners now let me introduce you some 2d shape but first i will tell you about 2d shapes their introduction having only two dimensions such as width and height but no thickness squares circles triangles stars etc are two dimensional objects also known as 2d shapes so 2d shapes are two dimensions has to, has two dimension and their dimensions are width and height but they are not thick they have no thickness they are flat surface they have flat surface so we call them two dimensional shape or we can also call them 2d shapes and some examples of 2d shapes are here Square, circles, triangles, stars, etc. There are lots of two D shapes, and today we will learn them, and we will learn their properties as well. So let's start the work. We start with this shape. Can you look at this shape? This shape is a closed shape with straight lines. Can you can see there is no open edge here. So we can say it's a closed shape with straight lines. So can you count its sides first? Good. So count with me. One, two, three, four. This shape has four sides. So I'm writing four here. Now count its corners. Do you know what are corners? Corner is the point where two lines meet. So these are the corners. Count them. One, two, three, four. This shape has four corners. And have you observed this? Shape has all sides same, so a flat surface shape, a two D dimensional or two dimens or two dimensional shape with flat surface and straight lines has four sides and four corners. What is the name of this shape? Good, it's a square shape. So I'm writing square here. Now, look at the second two D shape. Again, a closed shape with straight lines. Can you count its sides? One, two, three. It has three sides. Now count the corners. One, two, three. It has three corners. So this is the flat shape with three sides and three corners. And can you know the name of this shape? Do you know? Yes, it's triangle. So I'm writing its name down. It's triangle. Now 
Do you know why we call this shape a triangle? Tri means three and angle means angle. Do you know what is angle? Angle is the point where two lines meet. This is one angle. Here two lines meet, it's an angle. Here two lines meet, they are making an angle. So, in this figure or in this shape, there are three angles. So, we call this shape triangle shape. Now, we are moving towards next shapes. Now, again, a closed shape with straight line and count the sides first. One, two, three, four. This shape has four sides. Now, count its corners. Corner means where two lines meet. This point is called corner. So, count the corners. One, two, three, four. This shape has four corners. So, this shape has four sides and four corners. And look at this shape. The length of two opposite sides are same. So, we call them parallel. So, parallel sides length is same here and here. So, a flat surface shape, a 2D shape, a closed shape with four sides and four corners and two parallel sides has the same length. This shape is called, yes, it's called rectangle. So, I am writing its name here, rectangle. Now, we are moving towards our next shape. Look at this shape. I know it's a very simple shape. Is this shape has side? Or any corner it has? No. So, this shape has no sides and no corners. So, this flat surface shape, a uh, hmm, closed shape, a 2D closed flat surface shape has no corners and no sides. And what we call it? Yes, this shape is called circle. So, I am writing its name. So, these are the properties of the shapes we have written here. And again, I am telling you, this is square, triangle, rectangle and circle. These are 2D shapes. And let me tell you about more 2D shapes. So, we are moving forward. Look at this shape. A shape with four sides or a closed shape with straight lines. And shape, a closed shape. With flat surface, can you tell me the sides of this shape? Count it first. 1, 2, 3, 4. This shape has 4 sides. Now count its corners. A corner is the point where two lines meet. 1, 2, 3, 4. This shape has 4 corners. And the, look at its outline shape. Its outline shape refers to the shape of diamond. That's why we call this shape a diamond shape. So, it's a diamond shape with four straight lines. Uh, this is a diamond shape with four sides and four sides and four corners. A closed flat shape, two dimensional shape. Now look at the, this shape. Can you count its sides first? One. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. This shape has 10 sides. Now count its corners. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This shape has 5 corners. So, a shape with 10 sides and 5 corners and a flat surface. A closed shape with straight line is called, yes, its name is star. So, this shape is called straw shape. Now, these are the six shapes you have already learned in your previous years. But today, I am introducing you some more 2D shapes. Look at them and listen to their properties carefully and learn them and learn their names also. So, this is the first shape. I hope this is a new shape for you. It's, it's shape, this shape has straight lines. A closed shape, a two-dimensional shape. Can you count its sides? Yes, you can. So, count with me. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This shape has 5 sides. Now, the next step is to count the corners. So, count it. 1, 2, 
three, four, five. This shape has five corners. So five sides and five corners. A straight line shape. Can you tell me its name? Okay, I will tell you. This shape is called pentagon. What it is called? Pentagon. Let me write its name here so you can read it. It's pentagon. So this shape is called pentagon. So remember, a shape with five sides, five corners, a closed flat surface shape is called pentagon. Now look at this shape. Again, a shape with straight lines, flat surface, 2D shape. First count its sides. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. This shape has 6 sides. Now count its corner. A corner is the point where two lines meet. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. This shape has 6 corners. Now a shape with 6 corners and 6 sides, a flat surface, a closed shape, a 2D shape. It is called, it is called hexagon. So I am writing its name here. It's hexagon. Please learn the name of these shapes, the sides and corners. So please learn their properties properly. So these are the two dimensional shapes or we can say these are 2D shapes. Now the last one. Again a shape with straight lines. A closed shape, a flat surface. So count its sides first. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. This shape has 8 sides. Now count its corners. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Again 1, 2, 3, 4. 5, 6, 7, 8. It has 8 corners. So this flat surface shape, a closed shape with straight lines, has 8 sides and 8 corners. So its name is octagon. What is its name? Octagon. So I am writing its name here. So you can learn it properly. So, this 2D shape is called octagon. So these are the shapes. We have learned their properties, their names, their sides, corners, each and everything. So learn them, learn their sides, their corners, their names and the spellings properly. Now we are moving towards our learner's book page. First look at the day and date slide. On the learner's book page, on the extreme top, you will write your Monday. Then in the center of classwork, then you write 14th December, 2020. Please write your day and date very neatly. And please draw a line. So, you'll, <clears throat> so you can write properly. So this is the learner's book page. The topic is shapes. You will need lots of triangles. This is the game of triangles. Make a star shape with some triangles. So, they are making star shape with the help of triangles. So, this is an activity you can do at your home by yourself. It's very easy. Take some um, cut out of triangles or you can draw some triangles and cut them. Then make shapes with them. How many different star shapes can you make? You can see they can they make the star shape. This is a star. And how many triangles are used here? Yes, there are two triangles used here. So, look at this one. How many triangles are used for, to make this shape? Out, as you look at this shape, it's a star. So, how many corners in, are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 corner star. And how many triangles are used? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 triangles are used and it has 6 corners. Now, 6 corners means 6 points. Now look at inside the shape. Can you see there is another shape here. Can you count its corners first? One. Let me mark it. This is one, two, three, four, five, six. So this shape inside 
you can see inside shape it is six corners now count the sides one two three four five six so inside there are six sides and six corner do you remember we have just learned a shape with six sides and six corner do you remember the shape name yes it's hexagon so they made a star with triangles six triangles are used and if you look at inside another new shape has made and that is hexagon now we are moving towards our next part what if you use different types of triangles together to make a star so you can use triangles to make stars do this activity at home i hope you will enjoy it can you use different shapes to make pattern of pictures with the help of these shapes triangles squares circles pentagon hexagon you can make many shapes many patterns can you make shapes with seven eight or more sides can you make a pat pattern or picture with the line of symmetry so do you know what is line of symmetry line of symmetry is the line that on both side of that line the pattern or pic or picture will be same you can see this is the line of symmetry both sides have triangle shape so they can make also this shape with the help of two triangles now look at this pattern they used how many squares and triangles count the squares 1 2 3 4 they used four squares and how many triangles two triangles so it say they use four squares and two triangles to make that pattern and they draw a line in the center this is a triangle lines can you tell me what this line is called this line is called line of symmetry this is called line of symmetry do you know why because if you look at put the mirror on this line and look at that side the pattern will be same the image in the mirror will be same like this and if you put the mirror on this side and look at the mirror you will find the same image it means in line in line of symmetry both sides are same the pattern on the both side will be exactly same so these are the activities with star shape you can do at your home and you will enjoy it i must say now we are winding up our lesson plenary question complete a rectangle has dash sides so do you remember the rectangle a closed shape a flat surface shape with four side and four corners but two opposite or parallel sides are have the same length so how many sides it has yes a rectangle has four sides now look at the b part an octagon has dash corners now remember the octagon shape yes an octagon has eight sides and eight corners a flat surface shape with straight lines a closed shape with eight corners and eight sides so how many corners it has eight now c part a pentagon has dash side do you remember the shape of pentagon yes good a pentagon has is, is a 2d shape with straight line it has flat surface it's a closed shape with with five sides and five corners so how many sides yes it's five so pentagon is a shape with five sides and five corners octagon is a shape with eight corners and eight sides these are all 2d shapes two dimensional shape now the last part a hexagon has dash corners and dash side now the next shape is hexagon have you remember the properties of hexagon hexagon is a 2d shape with straight lines a closed shape with flat surface it has six sides and six corners so how many corners and sides yes it has six corners and six sides so these are the shapes 2d shapes two dimensional shape so please learn their properties properly and try to learn their names their spellings properly so that's it for today inshallah we will meet in the next lesson but but do practice of the today's work at your home learn the shapes their names their properties and remember their shape also inshallah we will meet in the next lesson take care of yourselves allah hafiz thank you